to the love of my life, the day is finally here. When everyone asks me if I'm nervous, I think, no, I'm not. Why should I be nervous when I'm committing my life to the one person in this world that calms me when life is chaotic? The one person in this world that loves me for who I am, yet pushes me to be better. The one person who looks out for my interests even when I fail to. Who would have thought I was looking at my future husband that Friday night when I spotted that cute coach on the football field fall 2017? If not for that first look and your persistence, I don't know if we'd be here today, but thank goodness we are. That persistence of yours has served us so well, from being a goof until you get a laugh out of me to fighting for us. Can't really pinpoint when I knew you were the one, but I remember how comfortable I felt on our first date, how natural it felt to be with you. Thank you for giving me your all even, and especially when I have trouble seeing it. Thank you for evolving and growing over our time together so far. I know it's been quite a challenge at times. Neither of us are the same people we were when we met, for the better, I'd say. Oh, look at you. There are blueberries on your boutonniere. Oh, interesting. Is that my snack later? <laughs> <laughs> you are a force to be reckoned with, and I have learned to stand aside and let you do your thing. The fact that we basically have the same brain should speak volumes to how compatible we are. So, when people ask me if I'm nervous about marrying my person, the answer is hell no. Look at her. What do I have to be nervous about? I love you, always will, and our life together will be a breeze because we are better together. You truly are my best friend. You know me better than anyone else. You love me, you see my beauty, especially on the days I struggle. I hope I always make it known how grateful I am to have you in my corner. You are my favorite person in the world, Gregory Ryan. I am so excited for every day I get to call you my husband. Every day I get to do my best to show you how much you mean to me. Every day we get to spend together. I love you so much, babe. We're forever better together. You guys are made for each other. I remember the first time that you guys came into my lives, Melanie a little sooner than Greg, but it was sports that brought you together and they've decided to make a solemn commitment to each other to spend the rest of their lives together. And they know that the path isn't always going to be easy, but it'll be worth it. And you guys have decided to make this commitment before friends and to make this commitment to each other. I, Melanie, choose you, Greg, to be my husband, to support through the wins and the losses on the field and in life, to nurture and grow with you through the changing seasons of our lives. No matter what, I will always remember how grateful I am to have you by my side. I, Greg, choose you, Melanie, to be my wife, to support through the wins and losses on the field and in life, to nurture and grow with you through the changing seasons in our lives. No matter what, I will always remember how grateful I am to have you on my side. There's a tradition in the Jewish faith that you step on a glass. As long as the glass is shattered, your love will always last. All right, here we go. Oh, Break it. oh come on. Smash it, Greg. <laughs> uh, uh, what kind of life did you get? Grab the one from the name. <laughs> This will get it done. <laughs> okay. Here we go. We got this. Yeah. There's a saying that when our children find true love, their parents find true joy. 
And speaking for Lisa, I can say that we're finding true joy with Greg in our lives. One thing I'll say about you, Melanie, is that you're unique. You know who you are, you know what you want, and most importantly, you have the courage to stand up for your wants and beliefs. So now, it's time for the two of you to pave your own unique journey, knowing that your mom and your dad and your family will always be here for you and Greg. and tell you that friendship means a lot to me. And I just want to honor what friendship really means and what it brings in our lives. Because being here together today is a gift of friendship. If I had one piece of advice to share, it's always to be each other's best friends. Please raise your glasses. And join me in wishing Greg and Melanie a life filled with joy, happiness, and children. Marriage is a, it's a long path from here, and there'll be good times and bad times, but it's the way you come through both of those that really defines who you are as a couple. The day we put off being Greg as himself and Melanie as herself, and they come together to form a new family with a beautiful name, Olwyn. I wish you guys so much happiness and success in your marriage and throughout your lives. You may now kiss the bride. I now present to you guys, Bubbles, <laughs> Bubbles, Bubbles. I now present to you all, Greg and Melanie Olwyn. <laughs>